guys, 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 guys. We need to clear this whole place. We move the table. We're about we to move, resurrect we, uh -huh. mm -hmm. we should be right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Kunle Akwayemi Oluwa Remy is a Nigerian actor who is best known for his roles in Falling, A Family Forever, Tinsel, and more recently, the Netflix hit movie Anikulakbo. Anikulakbo. So much more. He definitely is here. Of course, you know, he won um, uh, Golda Ultimate Search in 2010. <laughs> ah, so please, 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 please do not despise the days of, uh, you know, great beginnings. It's, Welcome to Work of Nigeria. His guy has been around. Long after. You are so much. welcome to the show. Thank you. It's so good to have you. Um, I mean, it's as if your career just went. You actually really be right. It's really if you if if I mean because you've been in the industry for you know a while, and I feel like this year has been your year, right? You not just in the movies but mm -hmm. social media. Mm -hmm. You have been practically intentional. Yeah. about your journey mm -hmm. tell us how, how what point did you get to this point did you get to this place where you are at right now i wouldn't say this year is um i, I wouldn't say it has been my year this year i'll say maybe this year has been is i've been seen mm. right all the work that you put in the past yeah years. it's been seen now mm. so it's more like people are catching up things are or people are accepting mm. Um, but yeah, it's, I've been, I've been waiting. You've been waiting? <laughs> I've been waiting, and not just waiting, I've not just been standing by, I've yeah. been working. Working, yeah, working. And true. so as, the fact that people are catching up now, <laughs> um, I'm still working. Yeah. So there's still, the world still needs to catch up, globally yeah. still needs to catch of up, course. so yeah. it never stops, I'm just, I'm just enjoying the trip and people are just jumping, jumping on board. Jumping on the, the board, the cargo on board is, yeah. Is, yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, so now, of course, I'm sure you've heard Mira like 150 million times. Is it good thing now in town? Is it? <laughs> does it does he annoy you at any point? So people no, see point, you and no. they actually doesn't, scream doesn't, it. Doesn't make you feel good. I mean, if for anything, it's, it's yeah. good that people can connect with you. It just shows that you've watched the film, yeah, you course. appreciate the film. Yes. And your role. So now tell me about the role. How was this getting into that particular character? Because oh, the well. fact that it was a very historic setting mm. and uh, the times they were in right now and then where your career has come from and all of that, the trajectory of it or how did you literally get yourself in that place to connect deeply with that story? How did I? Um, first, I was in the perfect environment for it. Okay. Right, so we shot in um, Igboja or your state. We were there for about two months. Mm. Any yeah. human being we get into character. character. Mm. Um, everything that surrounds you is mm. the... Is a reminder. Yes, the set was built. Mm. So you don't even see modern houses. You don't yeah, see nepa poles. True. You don't see... I mean, it was, mm. there's no way, except you're just a lazy person or just not um, really interested Into in being in project. that project, you would not get into character. Mm -hmm. So that already aided. Then talk about the makeup, mm -hmm. cyber marks, mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. costuming. Mm -hmm. Everything just made it work, mm -hmm. you know. And then with the fact that I was willing to also be, to also become mm -hmm. Saro, mm -hmm. Saro yeah. all that just, you know, mm -hmm. it was an engine with with a full functioning engine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we have seen, um, uh, we've heard a few actors or you know um, conversations that mm -hmm. I've had with of how they've struggled to move from one character. To another, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but here you are playing two different characters. You played Saru and you played Anikulaku in the same movie. Did you somewhat struggle a bit moving from this character to the other? Um, not necessarily. Is is the so Anikulaku is the is the title meaning I have death in my pouch. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, it's a it's it's a title he attained. Mm. But there was a human before that title. Yeah. Right? So there was really no transition. It's just that, what did he become? Did he, he became? Did he become pride? Was there pride involved? Did he become more arrogant? Did he? So it was just a level of upgrade of or a reveal of who is really beneath mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that humble person. Mm -hmm. Like I say, they say when you have money, that's when you know. That's well, when you know. Yeah, yeah, that's when you're the real character. I don't yeah. care. Yeah. I, mean, I want to see that character. See that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now, of course, we're talking about historic, traditional Nigerian movie now, and that role, Saru. And now we are taking you from that role, and then we are throwing you to another movie mm -hmm. that now sees you in uh, form as a pastor. 
So now tell us about Ijakumo. the latest Ijakumo. Okay, Ijakumo, I get to play a pastor, which I've always wanted to... So growing up, I always wanted to... I, 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 if, pastor were, if being a pastor was, um, was a career, I think I wanted to be a pastor. That's because I just admired... Really? Yeah. Okay. I think I have a calling. I'm just... <laughs> in the time God says, cool, I say, hmm? I just start Because that's a whole different world. Mm -hmm. um, so I've always looked forward to playing that, to, to being that. Mm -hmm. And then I got to play, the only thing is that playing it in the movie now, he's not such a good pastor, <laughs> right? Yes, yes, um, that's true. But he's still a pastor and he still has a congregation. Mm -hmm. So it's just, um, it's interesting. So for me, characters got to be interesting. Before, I could have probably just done anything mm -hmm. because I'm trying to, I feel like it's a boxing ring. I'm mm -hmm. trying to keep sparring, keep sparring. Mm -hmm. you know, to get in shape. Mm -hmm. um, but now I'm more selective. Why is it that character? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a pastor. Oh, this is his journey. Oh, mm -hmm. like, for example, the Saru ex two had a journey. A journey. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. we could all follow the follow progression, the progression. Which, exactly. which made mm -hmm. sense. Too. Mm -hmm. Jakumo is... Um, mm -hmm. It's a story after my heart. I love it. I really enjoyed making it mm. with Tony Abraham. Mm -hmm. Tony Abraham, she um, she's so passionate about this film. It's this is a baby. This is, she for her. She feels like this is the first film she's, she's every, ever doing. Yes, you know, aside yeah. from everything she's done, I think mm -hmm. as a, as an actor or a creative, mm -hmm. every new project you embark on should always feel like the first yes. and yes. the last. Because mm. what if that's the last? Oh, yes. I mean, so which means you put nothing but a hundred. Into it. Into it. True. And when I'm working with someone that's putting 100 into a project. Yeah, you got to put in the I don't have you know what's required. Yeah, same measure. measure. Yeah. So now, I want to know your mind generally when it comes to the Nigerian movie scene right now. Mm -hmm. It's getting a lot of attention from international um, platforms. Audience. Exactly. And uh, we're told, and now mm -hmm. it's funny because now we as producers mm -hmm. and of our own stories yeah. are now going in to really produce our Nigerian stories, as opposed to before, when we're trying to dub. Now, what do you think is happening now, and where do you see the movie industry in, like, let's say, 10 years? I believe that we're, we're accepting our, ourselves. Mm -hmm. I believe we're owning ours, right? We're, not, we're no longer trying to be or trying to fit in. I think now we are saying, take us as we are. Mm. As we are. I mean, look at it. Music has conquered that. Yeah, right? that's true. So if and and that's a very good, a very good footing for us. That's mm -hmm. a very good head start. If music could do that, mm -hmm. then we also and and it shows. So for me, Anikolako, for example, made it obvious that the world wants to see this. They want yes. to see the culture. They want to see. Yeah. We had more views even outside than in Nigeria. Yes, right? yes true. They want to see, and in different languages. languages. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it just shows that they want to see and understand the culture. And if we don't embrace this culture mm. and don't tell these stories, people will tell the stories the way. Mm. Like they did a with woman the woman king, king could have been told. <laughs> yeah. We could have told that story. story but exactly. here's the thing: I appreciate the effort. I love what they mm. did. My boy was mm. on it, PJ. Mm -hmm. Oh, sweet. But mm -hmm. here's the thing: if we told that story and we did it properly, mm -hmm. yeah. I'm told better. Yeah, it would have been deeper. more. It would be more language. language yeah, it would be yeah. deeper. And mm -hmm. but then again, they brought in a different level to it mm -hmm. that made it stand out. Mm -hmm. Right? We we probably don't have the. Budget. Mm -hmm. yeah, no. no, you can say it out loud. Yeah. Yeah, we don't have the budget. <laughs> so, no. uh, we don't have all of that to, you know, the action sequence and everything. But again, yeah. it's such an African story that yeah. we, we, we don't need to struggle with being yeah. speaking our language. Yeah. Yeah, I, mean, I don't true. need to go learn yeah. it. It's yeah. right there. Yeah. It's ours. Very okay. true. Um, I mean, you've been in the industry for a while. And um, aside acting, is right. there any other thing that you would, you know, do Be in the nearest future? Aside from being a pastor as well. <laughs> uh, 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 I said I used to want to. <laughs> <You> so. <laughs> I must say that. Don't, don't, don't set me up. Um, uh -huh. Okay, I'm, I'm a content creator. I'm actually a trained director, a filmmaker. Oh, nice. Yeah, the full okay. length. But um, I like the front of the camera. And there's always going to be time to morph. So I'm not under pressure. At all. It's a journey that I really enjoy. Mm -hmm. um, if I'm in front of the screen now, I feel like it's the time to be there. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's a... Either way, it's a ministry, mm -hmm. right? Now, this is not me going, I'm setting myself yeah, up. Right. This is not me you going back. Called, it's your <laughs> call me. Just but take whatever it, it is, you have an audience. Mm -hmm. um, so what are we preaching? What are we communicating with them? Mm -hmm. um, it could be politics. It could be yeah. gospel. It could be anything. But I have an audience. It's the same way with, um, I'm a content creator. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, and I just do it the way I, I do it differently. I, I feel I do it 
peculiar to mm -hmm. myself and the audience that I have grown with over time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I, I'm trying to get into music like my bros. <laughs> You're trying you to, to do music. music. No, I'm yeah, joking. Well, if you give me a character now to do music, <laughs> uh, we TikTok that music for you straight up. Ah, <laughs> nice. Okay, I know there's a particular question that's born in everybody's mind, so I'm just going to go ahead and ask it. Do you have your PVC? Yes. No, which PVC? <laughs> What's my own? It's your PVC. Yeah, I have my PVC. Yes, that's it's a good you. thing that you have Thank your PVC. you very much. Do you have a girlfriend? Do you have a lover? Do What's you have a side chick? Do this you have... Room? We want to so know. Can see. I'm say about why, why do they want to know? How is that important in this life? It's important. There's no pressure. Because now. we, oh, there's no pressure. No. This day, this day, wake up like the this. Last time I came, is there you, my, is when I get in my life, I say, how? Where's that? Is it? There's been a lot of speculation. Is so it you need ready, to please? let us know. It's not ready. There's been a lot of speculation. So you really need to let us know. And I'm not going to mention the name of the person that ah. you have been speculating about. <laughs> <I'm laughs> no, no, Bimbo is, Bimbo is my OG. Bimbo is my G you now, or forever. And, and, We've known each other for the longest time. So if we're going to date or date, it's not... She's amazing that we're not going to be hiding it, if you mm -hmm. get what I mean. She's not... And we are too much of clowns mm -hmm. to hide it. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's anything big. We're already in the industry anyway. Yeah. If I... So relationship outside the industry, I will protect it. Mm -hmm. Just personally, okay, that's personally. my own decision. So is that the situation? Yeah, okay. So, yeah. <laughs> Life like, is not that hard because you know what? What it's, let's it's say so Jack you will draw me and fuck your tail back. So. It's okay, please. It's okay to cross. It's okay. We have to head over to the kitchen, but hey, let's see if Jack watches. Uh -huh.